This is me, Rabab Zehra from TechX Media. We are at Jaisek Global 2025, and I have with me right now Mr. Ilya Leonov. He is Regional Director, Middle East, North Africa, at Positive Technologies. So let's welcome Ilya on TechX Media. Hi, Ilya. How are you? Hello. All good. Thanks for invitation. It's great to have you here with us again. Uh, so, Ilya, uh, we are at Jaisek Global 2025. um and you have been participating in the event from past couple of years tell us how different this year's jaisek is from the previous years yeah sure so from our experience what we notice amount of the technologies amount of the companies are growing so we also extending our presence here in uh, jaisek not only from the stand perspective we where we are presenting our latest technologies and uh, different uh, attack vectors which been used by threat actors globally but also the the hacker sphere where we've been presented for like a second year in the row so we have uh, two times more larger space there where we were able to set up like a more practical and hands on uh, workshops like uh, hacking devices hackathon stenography and the soldering so for us it's definitely a great opportunity to see that uh, you know the exhibitions becoming bigger the interest is becoming bigger so we are contribute from our end as well great uh, so uh, during the past few months we have seen that positive technologies has been there in several incidents be it uh, fixing the vulnerabilities in uh, routers or fixing uh, or coming as a uh, life saver when it comes to big cyber attacks So okay, would you like to share some recent incidents with us where positive technologies has played a role? Yeah, sure. So we are continuously actually looking for this uh, vulnerabilities or zero days vulnerabilities and we have a team of uh, real experts which is recognized uh, globally worldwide for this capabilities to discover the zero days. Uh the recent one which you read about the uh, routers and also some um like a hardware vendors where we've been able to identify the zero days and we cooperating with the benefit manufacturers and the vendors to fix these vulnerabilities so on the yearly basis we are discovering more than 200 actually and once it is fixed like we make sure that uh, it's not uh, a vulnerability anymore we are definitely go public with the vendors so based on those incidents what uh, steps should organizations take now uh, to combat cyber threats It's actually a, a set of uh, steps I would say starting from the continuous uh, vulnerability scanning and uh, making sure that the devices that they're using the software uh, they're using is up to date the personnel which is working with these technologies is uh, aware about the you know cyber hygiene about like uh, some basics in the cyber security and definitely from us uh, from the perspective of the cyber security professionals you need to be like always uh, one step ahead of the threat actors which is not easy but uh, we are let's say contributing our expertise our knowledge to make sure that the maturity level of cyber security in the country in the region is uh, elevated that's great thank you so much for being here with us it was a pleasure talking thank you thank you as always thank you for watching stay tuned to techx to know more about what is happening at jaisek global 2025 goodbye Thank <laughs> you.